A lot of families are on alert after a student at Anderson County High School contracted hepatitis A, prompting the school to mandate all students get vaccinated against Hep A by September 7th. Eleanor Buckley has more about where and when students can get vaccinated. It's the LEX 18 Big Story at 530. A case of hepatitis A in the Anderson County schools has parents concerned. Now the Department of Health is suggesting all students get vaccinated before returning to school. It's scary. I don't want my child to get hepatitis A. News spreads quick, especially through the walls of a high school. We heard it through her phone. Actually, she got a text about it. That message relayed instantly to Dane Wiley, the father of a middle schooler, almost as quickly as the virus can spread itself. That's what worries me, because it can spread so quick, you know, easy. It's just through food, anything. You got to wonder where it come from, you know? Or did it originate here? Wiley is having his daughter get vaccinated through the Department of Health. They are providing a free vaccination to anyone who qualifies under the Vaccines for Children program. I'm glad they are. I mean, I'm thankful, you know. But I wish they'd gotten a hold of this sooner, a lot sooner. And Dane Wiley isn't the only one concerned. Mary Ann Kennedy fears for her grandchildren. Well, it's kind of scary because yeah, I know a lot of kids in Anderson County High, and I was hoping it wouldn't come to Anderson County, but it's, it's, it's scary for grandparents, parents, and the kids. The kids, my grandkids are really concerned. All students that qualify to receive the vaccine will have it available at the Anderson County High School at 3.30 p.m. on September 6th. Covering the news in Anderson County, from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom, back to you.